Welcome back, travelers. We haven't had any Dragonspine-related events in a long time. In fact, the last event tied to Dragonspine was Shadows Amid Snowstorms in version 2.3 back in 2021. But yesterday, we finally got some exciting news about the long-awaited Dragonspine event, and even a surprise rerun. So without further ado, let's dive in. According to a post shared by Fowl, a reliable source in the community, we'll be getting a Dragonspine-related event in version 5.2. And that's not all. Wanderer will also have his third rerun in the 5.2 update. This is quite surprising considering he just had a rerun in version 4.6. There are still plenty of characters who haven't had reruns in a while, and we've seen no signs of them yet. However, this rerun of Wanderer feels special in a way. In version 4.8, we had the main event Summertide Scales and Tales. And if you completed that event, you might remember Wanderer's role in it. At the end of the event, Wanderer told Albedo that B mentioned Durin's possible resurrection. And Albedo confirmed that this was indeed possible based on his observations. To get new characters, you can buy Crystal from Lootbar.gg. It's a best top-up platform for games like Honkai Star Rail and Genshin Impact. Big Name Dakuja and Tiva Times are also are using for crystals. It saves you up to 20% of the actual in-game price for every item available and an extra 5% for your first purchase. The process is very simple. First, go to Lootbar.gg, select Genshin Impact, select your pack, then put your UID, select region. Just tap on top up now, select preferred payment method, and get your Genesis crystal. If you do want to top up in your account, we are getting double the currency for our first in-game purchase. Then I highly recommend you, check out lootboard.gg through the link in the description and in the pinned comment. He even asked Wanderer and Mini Durin to help him when the time came. After that, Mini Durin left for Teyvat with our lovely hat guy. Considering all this, there's a high chance Durin might be resurrected in this upcoming 5.2 event. Durin's heart is still beating, and Albedo noted that it's beating faster than before. Plus, Mini Durin is currently wandering around with Wanderer. So, the Wanderer rerun in 5.2 could be a big hint that he'll participate in the main event, and sources have confirmed this theory. A few months ago, around versions 4.6 or 4.7, there was a leak suggesting we'd get a new character named Doreen in future patches. This implies Doreen could become a playable character, and we might even see his humanoid form in version 5.2. The last two Dragonspine events were fantastic, and I'm confident Hoyoverse will deliver another amazing story, especially with their promise to focus more on the narrative in Natlan. Now, which other characters might appear in version 5.2? Well, Chaska is pretty much confirmed to release in 5.2 as a 5-star Anemo unit. As for her playstyle, she's expected to be a main DPS with a unique ability to fly. According to White, when Chaska flies, she'll have bird-like wings on her back, similar to when we glide. But it's unclear whether these wings are accessories or an actual part of her body. We didn't see any wings in the teaser or trailer, so they may only appear when she activates her skill. Chaska's normal attacks can trigger a coordinated attack with her skill. She can also transform her element into Hydro, Electro, Pyro, or Cryo. But Geo and Dendro are not part of her kit. Besides her, Auroran is also expected to release in version 5.2, though his rarity is still unknown. I'm considering him as a 5-star for now. If he's not, then characters like Venti and Riothsley might get reruns in 5.2. Venti's rerun could tie in with the Dragonspine event, and Riotsli's because he hasn't had a rerun since his release in version 4.1.